what's good youtube it's your man king dev and we back baby with some more jujutsu kaisen they were checking out episode 10 last time mojito he pulled up to the theater and he turned some kids into some demons or some curses rather or some human curses to some degree i don't really understand what he did he manipulated their body and we found out they were humans you know what i mean so they weren't officially curses but um yeah he got some weird power he also like i don't know we, we were introduced to junpei he's this other strange kid who was in the theater but he wasn't killed and i feel like mojito's trying to manipulate him i don't know because you know he had a rough upbringing and obviously it, it, it seems like he he manipulates people's hate towards other people to some degree because we know junpei had a rough upbringing i feel like he's trying to manipulate him to some degree i'm not sure what exactly he's trying to do but i'm sure it's not going to end well we also met nanami cool fly smooth criminal yes sir we introduced to him he got like an op power he's with um itadori at the moment and they went and investigated um they looked further into this whole incident at the theater or whatever but at the end he found he, he basically said that mojito was leaving bait for him like come find me but he sent itadori on a dummy mission because he didn't want to bring him with him he'd rather do it on himself and that's where we are right now listen i've been enjoying jujutsu kaisen and I'm looking forward to this episode. If y'all enjoy this, make sure you drop a like, hit the subscribe button, and share this with your mom. Okay, share it with your mother. Thank you. And with that being said, man, I ain't gonna hold y'all up no more. Let's jump back into it. I'm looking forward to it. Yes, yeah, sir. Kanagawa Prefectural Satakuzala Movie Club. Yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> it bored me to death. <laughs> oh, God. Delinquent, you can tell by his face. They only want it because you in there. All right, you're gonna step on my my, my tapes? <laughs> Word, that's my favorite movie. Where where's the um like president or principal or like you know anybody with authority? I'm taking it home. What you talking about? Oh, the movie you stepping on. I need that. <laughs> I need that. Get up off it. So I can't. Is this pre like Mojito or is this after he's been with Mojito? Like maybe he got something up. Oh, God damn. <laughs> you good, my boy? Kicked him right in his face. Y'all, it's time to squabble. Let's squabble then. And they left. They some fake ass friends. Y'all get better friends than them. Because I would have kicked him right in his face right now while he's squatting down talking to my boy. Yeah, and they beat his ass. That's tough. His friends ain't real, though. They scared. I understand. But, like, you ain't going to leave your boy to get bodied. No, sir. That's just not what you do. I'm not going to lie, y'all. I feel like we've been, like, six episodes without Sukuna. That's what it feels like. I ain't going to lie. Where is he at, boy? Why is he still laying dormant? Look how sad he looks. I definitely feel like he can get manipulated and used. Like, why would he keep you alive and not the others? Humans can't live without making up excuses. What is this out here, sir? What's back here? A demon? A curse? And that's a... Interesting. That's a human as well. That looked like the thing from SpongeBob that wanted the, uh, the chocolate. Was that the episode with the chocolate? Wow, he's saying life is unimportant. Basically, even if somebody dies, like the world keeps going. Hey, this is some crazy way to think. I ain't gonna lie. You can kill someone if you're angry. And he said, I'm gonna sanction you. Junpei, I think you got yourself into some trouble, my boy. I don't think you understand what's really going on here. I'm just saying, I don't think he's aware of what's actually going on here. I'm not even fully aware of what, what like, Mahito's up to, you feel me? I just know he's up to no good. I could tell based on his character design. Nobara? <laughs> Still getting tossed. Okay. Damn, I'm glad they broke the, like... It, it was pretty tense, I ain't gonna lie. Uh. Oh, they want to see if he can see it. But if he does some himself, then you'll know. 
Yes, sir. If necessary, if necessary, we're gonna do it by force. And if we're if we're wrong, we just say sorry. It's simple. They said basically if he got too much sauce and you ain't ready for him, we're going back to Nanami. Oh, but it's different? It's different when it's a human? Okay. Oh, that means they're higher, actually. Okay. So you wouldn't be on the same level as the spirit you're expecting to exercise. You'd be stronger, essentially. So he said he's barely able to take a level two, but that, that would make Junpei a little bit stronger than a level two, if that makes sense. Maybe I understood that incorrectly, but that's my understanding. Sheesh, just blood all in the source. Nanami's down here butchering things. That's why. Look at the shoes. Sharp as hell. Ugh. He said, I don't really like doing this, even though they look ugly. I know they still people at heart. Uh oh, here we go. I'm nervous for Na Nanami. I ain't gonna lie. Let's settle this. Okay, shime shime shu. Oh yeah, Nanami versus Mahito. All I want to say is Nanami, be careful, my boy, because I actually like you, bro. I just met you, bro. <laughs> this dude. <laughs> and then we come back to this dude. <laughs> An actual good battle, like two two strong individuals. That boy is fighting in a nice suit. Ooh. He can see the crits. Oh my god, he cold with it. He blocked. Ooh, give me that hand. Broke his wrist. Yeah, he, he's definitely like a, a zombie or a puppet or some sort. Mm. The soul or the body. Man, stop entertaining him, Nanami. Stay on your toes and be his ass. You don't have to listen, though. You don't have to listen. Idol Transfiguration. So the day's almost over. <laughs> I heard you. I felt that, y'all. Like, I've been here eight hours. It's time to go. <laughs> I'll be at the clock five minutes before eight. I, like, I need to go. Is this the teacher that watched him get beat up but didn't help? You know damn well we wasn't friends, dude. Yeah, I hope he saw you. What are you saying to me, sir? That's how you end up overgrown children. He getting irritated. Stop talking at me like that. I want to know what he did to you. <laughs> Terrible teacher, y'all. I hope you punch him in his mouth. <laughs> Itadori, what are you doing? <laughs> he said he can see it. How do you know he's seen it and then just see you? <laughs> Itadori might have just saved that man's life. I ain't gonna lie. Mind your business, sir. Thank you. <laughs> pants team. Run. Now run. <laughs> he took the whole pants, though. <laughs> he took the whole pair of pants. <laughs> hey, yo, what are we watching this episode, man? Don't question it, bro. He looped the block. Oh. Yeah, you was about to murder him or something. What was you about to do? You throwing up gang signs. What was you about to do? Hmm, maybe maybe Itadori can bring him back to us. Cause he he might be lost, y'all. Jeez, right back to it. Nice. Stay on your toes, my boy. <laughs> Cut him up, dice him. On the roof? He on the ceiling? I'm about to say, he look like he enjoying himself. Oh no, the human part of him. So don't forget that. Don't hesitate. Put him out their misery, if anything. 
He said, don't worry about it. Let's continue. Don't wipe the tears off that thing. Slay that. Put him out of his misery and get back to fight. How you let him get on you like that? Okay, he changed his body. Oh, wow. Hey, Mahiro kind of cold. I don't know about this in Nami. We might have to slide. Oh my god, I love the freaking <laughs> cinematography, like the choreography and everything. Like the way the camera panning, like, whoa. Oh, he's trying to get up out of there. Look at him pursuing him. Oh my god. What am I looking at right now? In a fly ass suit. Come on, stop playing with him. Six o'clock, boy. It's time to go home. Oh, he said, I'm done playing. I'm going into overtime. Overtime, Nanami. Oh my God. Yo, that exchange between Mojito and Nanami was fantastic. Hold on. Let me check and make sure there's no uh, Jujutsu stroll. You feel me? Yes, yeah, sir. Someone stole it. Panda Senpai, you wearing it? Oh. You haven't seen it, are you? <laughs> are you serious? She got the hammer. <laughs> hey, yo. I'm putting this one in. It's a good one. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Beat them both. Two fools. <laughs> yeah, this is a crazy. Oh, that's Maki's. Oh, hell no. Please hit him with a hammer. <laughs> Yo. Not Gojo still in Nobara's skirt, though. What is happening, y'all? <laughs> Yo, that was. I think that was my favorite Jujutsu stroll so far. Like, what is happening? Panda in that tight ass jacket are you serious nah this was a good episode a lot more dialogue i feel like they're building up uh junpei a little bit more junpei and uh mahito mahito's an interesting character he got a strong focus on this whole soul thing the soul comes first he manipulates the body around it which is why nanami even said like it doesn't matter about the mass of the original body like he manipulates it he can make it real small or he can make it larger than what the original was which is interesting but i want to know how much truth this is like inside this universe or or if he's just like you know psychotic and he's just you know talking like a, a villain would talk or whatever i don't know he's an interesting character he is holding his own against nanami and nanami is great one so i want to see his ultimate potential but listen nanami said i'm be off at six o'clock he said that earlier and then he like shit it's six o'clock i'm still working so i guess it's overtime listen take the tie off real quick wrap it up let that sauce on you know let that sauce out you feel me yeah i'm looking forward to see the fight i, I ain't gonna lie i am concerned for nanami just because he seemed to be like fleeing and, and Mahito was actively pursuing him. I know he did this little power up, which got me excited. But like, I just don't want nothing to happen to him because I just met him and I actually like his character. So hopefully he gets out this okay. Hopefully Junpei, uh, hopefully Itadori can get Junpei to like chill out. I don't know. He's, he seemed like he'd been through a lot. He got a lot of hate towards humans. So I don't know if he's going to be able to, if Itadori going to be able to bring him back if he's like too far gone. I don't know, but I guess we just got to sit back and, and see what happens. Um, listen, if y'all enjoyed this, y'all want more Jujutsu Kaisen, man, drop a like and a subscribe button. More will definitely be coming. And, um, yeah, man, just have a great day. I'm gonna see y'all in the next episode. Peace out.